Welcome back, everybody. It's time to spotlight two more local high school students who are not only excelling in the classroom, but in their sport as well. Here's a bit more about our first A-plus athlete, Caitlin Dryden of Ellender Memorial High School in Homa. like bowling because it's something that I can count on myself and I also count on my team we all come together as one but we're also really like we're responsible for ourselves to be the MVP it means that you have to be a leader and even when you're having a rough day you have to smile through it and even when you like even when it's difficult or when you're having your off day or you're not bowling so great as you normally do, you still have to try to keep up the good morale for your team members so everybody does great. And you might not be at your best, but your other teammates might be and they might need the extra push. Being number one at school is really crazy to me because I didn't really grow up thinking that I was going to be it or that I was, it's not necessarily something I was striving to do, but something I just, I always looked at school and wanted to work hard and wanted to put in my effort and it paid off. I was really excited. I, I thought that there was a whole bunch of people, so maybe they wouldn't pick me, or maybe I wasn't the first choice, but then I, they announced it on the loudspeaker at school, and I was really shocked. I was like, wow, it, it's crazy that I've been working so hard for so long, and it finally feels like it's paying off. I am hoping that I have graduated college and that I'm on the right track to becoming a therapist to help other people. So great, congrats to her. Now from a, a patriot to a crusader, everybody, here is our second A-plus athlete, Nick Malik of Brother Martin High School, right here in New Orleans. Football for me, it's, a, it's a, an emotional sport. You know, it's a passion-driven sport, so, you know, just like the, the feeling of walking out the tunnel and stuff like that, it's just like, it gets me going, it's the best part about it. I enjoy it a lot because I know that I was in that position one time, you know, people that have came before me helped build me to what I am now. So seeing like, being like a little piece in somebody else's story, is, it's pretty exciting. You know, we have a, a sign at Brother Martin that we hit before every practice, so it's kind of like flipping the switch. Like, that's a big deal, you gotta flip the switch. So as soon as I walk back out, yeah, I'm exhausted, but I, I'm like, it's time to change. Now it's time to get back in school mode, you know, get ready to go. It started really on Monday, you know, starting at practice, but like Thursday afternoon after a walkthrough, and that Friday morning, there's nothing like it. It's like a kid on Christmas, you know? It's, it's a great feeling. Uh, I think I'm gonna go into sports medicine. Uh, just being around athletes and stuff like that, I can't see my, myself getting away from that anytime soon. Hopefully somewhere that involves a football field, whether it's coaching somewhere, even coaching in like, you know, the weight room or something like that. I hope it's somewhere on the football field. So it was exciting because again, like there's so many guys I, I think of in my head like, Wow, like, you know, like I'm thinking about guys from past years, even this year, like, who I know excel in the classroom too, and just to think that I got picked was, was a great feeling. Uh, congrats to all of them. We'd like to thank Fidelity Bank for sponsoring this segment. Now look, we'll spotlight more A-plus athletes next month, so make sure you tune in to find out who we feature.